Crystal. Welcome back to Cool Volcano Facts. The only volcano fact I know is, uh, I don't want to be near one when it explodes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, right, so I think I think they said uh, Prince Rolando is to the north of Middenhall, which is where we started. So, yeah, I guess we got a backtrack already. Actually, I think if you just go west, you mean it east? will be there. Yeah, yeah, east. I don't know east from west anymore. Yeah, <laughs> bro, the other day... The other day while I was recording Rants 4, I made the same mistake. I was looking at a walkthrough, and it said to go east, and I went west like a fucking dumbass. Yeah. I have to think of, uh, all the people who made fun of me for living on the west coast. And just think of what the what the opposite of the west coast is. Mm. <laughs> go, go, yeah. Yeah, go... <laughs> go north of the mountains like a normal human being? Probably. Man, I mean, you, th you think about the fact that I, uh, for the, the the thumbnail for Dragon Quest Part 1, I, you know, drew Bullbox with Bullbox's actual face. You just, th you just think about what the union between Bullbox and the princess must have looked like. Oh, that's disgusting. <laughs> These are all tentacle children. Oh, you're going back to heal? Yeah. Oh, that fuck that. Sense. I ain't dealing with those rats. Be careful about those rats. They'll get Seven you. food rats! Shit, which, which, which way is the inn? Oh, is is there an inn in the castle? There has to be. Oh wait, I th does the does the priest heal heal you? Uh, no, he just like cures your poison and shit. Mm. So he can he can bring me back from the dead, but he can't heal me. Right. Oh well. He's like the hospital from Earthbound. Reminds me of a. Uh... In Final Fantasy 3 on the Famicom... Oh! Oh no, that's an item shop. There we go, there's an inn. Yeah. In Final Fantasy 3 on the Famicom, there's a, uh... I think there's, like, a spring early in the game that... That, like, revives you to full health. Like, revives your party members to full health if they're dead, but does nothing if they're alive. So, so I just have... <laughs> Just have my party, like, beat each other to death if they were low on HP, so I could go back and heal. Damn. Yeah, I would do that, too. If I was in the same situation. <laughs> Are you playing on the only again? No. Yeah, I figured. I would, but I can't reach it from here. It's it's over on the uh, it's it's on top of the, the the entertainment center. The Nintendo Entertainment Center. <laughs> Your, parents Your parents help you hook it up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm glad you walked this way because if you walked north from Middenhall, you wouldn't be able to even get there. Walk this way. Talk this way. Yeah. It's, it's, it's blocked by the mountains and shit. Oh, look at that. Leveled up again. You should probably save up money for uh, defensive equipment because they already took off half your health. Oh, yeah. Let me... Let me... Smonk. Smoke weed every day. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> that was some good acting. The Lung Buster, 30 Inches of Doom. Yeah, my sister has long COVID, so she's, she coughs a lot whenever she smokes weed. Mm. I mean, I think even healthy people cough their lungs out when they smoke weed. Uh, I guess, I guess, eased? Yeah.
I remember I haven't played this game in a long time, so my advice isn't probably not that good anyway. But I remember the place where Rolando is was like on a peninsula. Oh, there it is. The penisilla. Yeah, Eastmost Peninsula is the secret. <laughs> is that from Zelda? Yeah. Zelda two. Zelda one. Mm. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember Zelda one having any peninsulas. Shut, shut the fuck up. It doesn't even have any peninsulas. I think it's like a mistranslation. Mm. Well, I'm glad you bought all those uh, medical herbs. Yeah. Because you're getting effed in the A. <laughs> this boy's gonna be high as a motherfucker by the time he finds Prince Rolando. Oh, and there's more in the treasure chest. <laughs> yeah. This game starts doing a thing in the dungeons where, oh, you'll see, you'll see when you do it, you'll see. Borlax chuffing back a fat dart. Yeah. Oh, That's what shit. I mean. What the? F this game does the thing where if you walk into like a darkness, like, like you can see the next area. Which basically means you can't see, like, all the dungeon at once. You have to walk into a new area. Fuck. But on the bright side, you don't have to, uh, use torches anymore. Or any shit like that. Finally got a response to the text. Let's see what it says. Alright, so I think this should be the, uh, the last episode we record tonight, but... Yeah, hopefully... Hopefully I have more time soon. Yeah. And what we're, time we're... is movie night? Hmm? What time is movie night? My, my, my dad said, what what time works for you? So I'm just like, hmm. Oh yeah, probably after this episode. Yeah. I'm just like, the, the sooner the better, probably. Yeah. Well, staying up, staying up for this helped me get on a normal schedule again. Hmm. We couldn't record this for the past, like, three days because I was kept falling asleep. Yeah. Meanwhile, I'm like... Yeah. I... You know, I put in my two weeks at the schnitz. And the, Yeah, my... my, Then suddenly, my boss decided to put me on day shift. You know, now that I'm trying to get my... Put my life back together. Yeah. Put your two weeks in at the... <laughs> To put your two weeks in at the shits. <laughs> Wiener shits all. That's what the security guard at Walgreens says whenever I go there after work. At least you're friends with the security guard. Yeah. Oh, cool, there's a guy here. Do you know that you can purify your body in the spring of bravery? Probably. Wonderful. Now let me pray for your well-being. Okay, thanks. You're doing a lot better than I thought you would do. Thank you, Father. You're welcome. Yeah, it's so funny. Yeah. Like, I can't even hear my own breathing, and yet the mic picks it up somehow. Yeah, I think that that's how it is for everyone. Oh, look, a big cobra. <laughs> oh, shit, he's fucking you. I, you better heal. Oh, never yeah. mind. Yeah, I got him. I guess I should have had more faith. Hopefully, after, uh... Yeah, hopefully after we recruit Rena R Rolando... I almost called him Ronaldo. I can, uh, stop smoking so much. Yeah. I don't know if he has, uh, healing spells to start out with. I think he does. Yeah, just... Rolando gets Borlax into rehab. Oh, maybe maybe he isn't in here because this is the end of the dungeon. Mm. I thought he was though. Oh, maybe like maybe he's there if you go back outside. Welcome to oh, the whatever. Spring of Bravery. Soak your body in these waters and seek the guidance of the Great Erdrick. May Erdrick's protection be bestowed upon the hero. 
By the way, are you here looking for the Prince of Cadoc? He did come here alone. The prince asked about a descendant of Erdrick that he might join. By now, he ought to be headed for Middenhall Castle. Man, this yeah, game's just sending us all around. Yeah. Well, if you don't if you don't want to walk back, you can use the Wing of Wyvern. I don't think I have any though. No, you don't. But you can buy one at uh, the Cannot Castle. Mm. You probably have a lot of money by now. At least a decent amount of money. Excuse me. I'm just gonna roll my chair over here, grab the automaton, the urge to play! Shit! Knocked one of my Nendoroids over. I don't actually I have any. <laughs> Sorry, I knocked one of my Nendoroids over, but I don't. It's it's not actually a Nendoroid. What is it? It's like a it's like a little figurine. It it's um It was a pre order bonus for Disgaea D two back in twenty thirteen. It's a yeah. The uh the the like pre order edition came with little figurines of Etna and Flan. And yeah, I've like kept those all these years, brought them with me to the hotel. Yeah. I have so much shit, I don't know where it is. <laughs> it's somewhere. I'll look for it. When I unpack from when I moved two years ago. <laughs> it really do be like that sometimes. All I the time? Move to... All the time. Sorry, what? I want to move to a new place, but probably there's probably not even any place cheaper than what this... Sad. Sucks. As long as I don't raise my rent two hundred more dollars this year, I should be fine. Uh, okay, okay, cool. There's the exit. Wow, you I'm found... surprised I was able to find that without help. Yeah. Well, that dungeon is pretty small anyway. Yeah, I like how the uh, the dungeon design's a lot less sprawling than in the first game. So far, yeah, it's like like it's like divided into sections instead of like fucking whatever whatever was going on in the first game. Yeah. Oh, you found some clothes. Do you even have any armor right now? Uh, even... I, would, I would hope so. Unless I'm fighting naked. That'd be crazy if you didn't even have any armor. <laughs> Uh, status, oh, probably. Yeah, status. Sorry, I had a brain fart there. Okay, I'm wearing leather armor. <laughs> then why? <laughs> why? Why are clothes even a thing? Yeah, it's just like the club. It's like shittier than what you already have. Also, why are you doing that? Oh, I thought I thought this was the way back to uh, Middenhall. Even if it was, like, why are you intentionally walking in the swamp? Because I, I can't go through the mountains. I thought you could, like, go north. Maybe. Oh, wait, I didn't see those mountains there. Yeah, I think I think that is the way back. At least it's, like, a shortcut. Yeah, and the enemies here are weaker than in the cave, so... I shouldn't have any problem keeping my health up. Yeah. They just pop up so frequently, though, that I might die anyway. Well, remember what I said, uh... If you're in the mountains or the forest, they appear more often. Yeah. You can probably walk back to Middenhall from here. Alright, let me just take one more herb. Just one yeah. more hit, man, I swear! And you probably don't even need to... Yeah, there's Middenhall right there. Oh, two slimes. They look like a cock and balls. Yeah. In one of the other Dragon Quest games, some girl says, oh, do you want to puff puff? And when you say yes, <laughs> she puts a blindfold on you. <laughs> but then when the, when the blindfold comes off, you find out that uh, it was two slimes instead of her <laughs> that's, boobs. That's funny. Yeah. Where is it? <laughs> Where is it? Talk to your dad in this game. He usually has some good advice. 
Hello, Dad. I'm in jail. It would be funny if he was like, oh, your your cousin was here, but he just left. <laughs> he gives you, you the ring of the roll. You've returned safely, Prince Borlax. A short time ago, the Prince of Canock came looking for you. But you were at Canock, and he knew that you would be returning here. Borlax, to reach the... So where'd he go? Where is he? What are you doing on my throne? <laughs> keeping it, so ke keeping it warm? Sorry, what did you say? Uh, that guy said I'm so happy for you. Oh. <laughs> I think. Man, where, 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 where the fuck... Uh, I don't think he's here. I think what the king said is like a mistranslation. Mm. He's not supposed to be here. I think he's at that town. Oh, to the west? Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, yes, I forgot. He's the man on the go who makes frequent stops. Oh, yeah, he's taking a piss with that guy who peed on his leg. <laughs> Oh yeah, you both missed me. I just Peter Pan kick they ass. Yeah, you got this, man. Yep, three iron ants. Fuck this. I hate regular ants. Can't imagine what I'd do if iron ants existed in real life. Well, don't watch that scene from Indiana Jones 4 where the ants, like, <laughs> crawl up all over that guy and, like, kill him. Yeah. Thanks for that. Thanks for the warning. Like, <laughs> I, 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 I genuinely mean that. Yeah, well, it's not like you're going to watch that movie anyway because it sucked. Oh, there he is. <laughs> oh. He's the guy in the end. Mm, I see him. He just like me for real. Yeah. Alright, uh, I guess you can voice him. I am Prince Rolando of Canock. Oh, are you Prince Orlax of Middenhall? I've been searching for you. Now then, let us join our power and fight together. Wow, that, that was a long... <laughs> I'd almost feel like that was what Deltarune was parodying with the, uh, the, the, like, the party member fanfare, except I think Toby Fox confirmed that it was a different game, like Secret of Manor or something. Yeah. But it's funny because that, that isn't, like, in literally every Dragon Quest game when someone joins your party. Uh, the, uh, the, the fanfare uh, that, like, goes for half a minute. Yeah. So, so I wouldn't be surprised if he was parroting that. Oh, you should see what you can buy at the store. Mm, yes. Or like the, the equipment and shit. Ugh. Oh, you have 386. The chainsicle. Oh, yeah, it's... Rude. Yes, uh, give, give me, give me like ten minutes. Alright. Ten minutes? Okay. Yeah, he does not know how to knock. <laughs> Honestly, man, you ever heard of knocking? Ha <laughs> ha yeah. Remember, <laughs> remember when I threw that, li <laughs> remember when I threw that line out for, uh, for Paper Mario Story and you used it and... You, I don't think you knew that it came from 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 Austin Powers, which is weird because I actually did watch them back then. Mm. Uh, yeah. Let's let's go gr like let's go farm for like four more gold so we can buy the uh, the armor. Do you want to buy it for uh, Rolando or Borlax? Uh, let's see. Who needs it more? Probably Rolando. Uh, let's see. Defense, 15. Oh, yeah, definitely, Rolando. 
Oh wait, Rolando he, can equip the clothes. Yeah, for now. Or, or no, he's wearing he's wearing leather armor. It's the same yeah. armor as me. He's a weak ass bitch. Yeah, even if he's at the same level you, as you, he'd be weaker because he's like a uh, he's like a thingy. He's like a thingy. Oh damn! He's like a he's like a magic user. Mm. So he his uh his strength isn't as big as much. Okay, I think think that got us enough gold. He can also learn like fire spells and shit. But they're not as good as uh Linda's or what whatever her name was. Get the fuck out of my way. Get the fuck out of my way. I'm playing Mike. <laughs> I'm playing Dragon Quest Builders. <laughs> yeah. Mm, the chainmail, that's that's what I was gonna That's what I was gonna call it. Yeah, give that shit to Orlando. He wants to equip it. Yeah, and you should chain sell mail for a chain smoker. Yeah, you I'm should gonna sell, sell the, the clothes and the the his his leather armor. Yeah. You should probably get him a better weapon than a club too when you can afford it. Yeah. Because nobody wants a club. Oh, he can afford a copper sword just like me. Yeah. Should I save up for a better weapon, though? Like a magic knife? Uh... I would just not have him have a club because the club sucks. Mm. But I'm saying, like, does the magic knife increase magic? Or do, do all the weapons just increase attack? Uh, pretty sure they all uh, increase attack. Alright. I'll just buy him the copper sword. Well... Then. Some of them can be used as items in battle to cast spells for free, but I'm, uh... I don't, I don't know if the magic knife is one of them or not. Yay! Okay, I guess we'll sell the club then. The entire club. Why did you say yay? Oh, just because he has a weapon that doesn't suck ass now. Okay. Yeah, it looks like all it looks like all of the uh it looks like all of the um weapons just increase attack. Right, and uh yeah, I once again forgot which way I'm supposed to go. So I guess I'll hmm. I don't think they told you which way to go, so you just have to Wait, I think I think actually he did say some guy mentioned a monolith, remember? Oh the little kid. Mm. Didn't he mention like a monolith or something? Yep. Yeah. Ah, yeah. West. Yeah, monolith soft. Yeah. I've never actually played uh, Z Z Xenoblade, but I should. I want to play a uh, Xeno Saga because uh, Jesus is in it, okay. and I love Jesus. <laughs> I thought you were going to say I want to play Xenosaga because Cosmos is hot. I think the the other girl is hotter than Cosmos. Uh, I, she, she's actually the only Xenosaga character that I know. Yeah, me too. But uh, I think there's like a, a girl who's like the main character. Mm. In the first Xenosaga game, she wears glasses. Oh, there's the monolith. So I think she's probably my favorite. Though in the other game she doesn't wear glasses, which makes me sad. There it is, man. Have you gone to the monolith that is south of Middenhall Castle? Hell no. Yeah, you did. South? Oh, right. Yeah, when, yeah, when, that, that, I, when, when I tried to go south of the castle, I got my ass handed to me. Yeah, I forgot, yeah. One that's, of my friends it. is waiting for your arrival there. Please go and meet with him. Please pass through. After a short walk south, you'll come to the town of Hamlin. <laughs> Hamlin, Boy, Hamlin, Ham McGill? Yeah. You mistake my kindness for weakness. I think there's something up there. Go back up there. 
Thankfully, I don't think there are any monsters in here. Oh, never mind. Whoops! Oh well. It's just weak ass bitches. Yeah. What? what spells does Orlando know? Uh, let's find out. Heal. Mm. Oh, cool. So he can just heal his own ass self. Yeah. Wait. Oh, he leveled up. Oh, cool. We have a Wing of the Wyvern now. Yeah. We'll just, and then... just answer this text again. Okay, we're good. Yeah, we're doing, uh, we're, we're watching Goldmember for f family movie night. And yeah, so, so I'm like texting my dad back and forth about it. Uh, yeah. But I'll... yeah, it, look, it looks like we got time to uh, finish up this episode before I have to, yeah, before movie night happens. Yeah, I was just I was just playing that game the other day. What game? Gold, Golden Eye 007. Oh. Yeah, that shit's on the Switch now. Yeah. Yeah, it sucks also, that. Also, is dead. Yeah. <laughs> uh, shit. Maybe maybe I'll just let myself die so that. You don't want to lose your money though. Okay, I think I have a wing of the wyvern, so for yeah. em for emergency purposes, I'm going back. Oh, I guess you can't. You can't wait. Hold on. Please, Mister Priest Man. Oh yeah, the priest can heal motherfuckers in here too. I think he's downstairs though. in here? Probably not. Nope. He's on the other side in the top left corner. I see him. Yes. Mr. Priestman, heal my cousin. Take him out of his fucking coffin. Oh. Oh, I guess no, the I priest guess... here doesn't revive. Yeah, I guess you have to go to lift wine. Oh, right, and sleeping, you know, at, sleeping at the end probably doesn't help either. No, it's like Earthbound where you have to go to the hospital. Man. Except instead of going to the hospital, you go to church. <laughs> yeah, I guess I forgot. Hold on. Yeah, I'm just I'm just going to uh, flee because that's... Cause I, there's nothing I like less than an unbalanced party. Because, like, if, you know, if, if Borlax gets a bunch of experience that Rolando's not getting, then... You know, the, the, the level gap is going to get even wider. Yeah, well, they catch up fast. In the, in the other Dragon Quest games, when you use the Wing of Wyvern, you can choose uh, which town you go to. Oh, that's cool. I thought it was like that in this game, too, but may I was misremembering it, maybe. Or maybe you can only go to certain towns. Uh, Dragon Quest 2... Oh, it, it it goes to the last place you saved in Dragon Quest 2. Ah, okay. Alright. Oh, wait. Is there, is there a priest here, or do I have to go to the castle for that? No, there's a priest here. Oh, cool. Revive. Yes, revive. Try new hydrating Volvic revive. Mmm, Splatterhouse. Yeah, it's another <laughs> game. Another religious game. Yeah. <laughs> CC's like putting together a list of like religious games and categorizing them by like. Games that are for God, games that are against God, and games that are, like, neutral toward God. Yeah. That's, Wait, that's, should, should, should I be talking about this in the episode? No, I don't care. Oh, okay. Uh, 
that's that's one reason why I wanted to play Zeno Saga because Jesus is in it. Mm. He's like part of the plot. It has to do with like Mary Magdalene and shit. I don't <laughs> fucking know. What the hell? Mary Magdalene is uh, Jesus's uh, Jesus, one of Jesus's followers. Oh, I thought I thought you were gonna say one of his Mormon wives. Uh, it 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 was one of his it was one of his wives mm. or his wife, or at least. I don't know what the, I don't know what the situation is on that. Some people think yeah. she was his wife. Some people don't. I don't know. I'll have to go back to Catholic school and read about it. <laughs> well, I believe the uh, the Mormon Jesus had three wives. It was like, I, yeah, two two of them had the same first name as his mother, which is weird. Yeah. Well, Mary Magdalene has the same name as his mother. Yeah. I mean, Mary, Mary Magdalene was one of them. Yeah. Or the other two. I don't remember. I, have, I, have, <laughs> I haven't watched the, uh, the band Mormonism cartoon in a while. <laughs> Those who remain neutral in the conflict between... <laughs> Between Elohim and the devil, we're cursed to have black skin. Yeah. Oh, now I remember. Now I remember. His his three lives were Sylph Sylphiet, uh, <laughs> Nocti, and Eris. Uh, I guess we'll end this episode on a cliffhanger. Oh, look, so, he learned to spell. Yep. But we'll see more about that next episode. Uh, if you folks enjoyed this video, the no further actions required on your part. If you got suggestions on other games you'd like to see us play, let us know in the comments. Next episode, we enter that monolith. Oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait to see what's in Monolith Soft's headquarters. <laughs> Long ago, a spirit child on one of these landings was conceived. Through an unidentified god is on his plot named Elohim. Elohim was conceived. This spirit child was later born to human parents. Near a mysterious star called Mormon Jesus.